welcome back for a new video. Today we are going to be showing you what I got my four month old for Christmas. I'm excited to share with you guys everything that I did end up getting her. I did do a full video on what I got my two year old. So if you're looking for gift ideas, you can check that video out. But today we are talking about my daughter Penelope, what I got her. If it's your first time here, do not forget to subscribe. I am doing a vlogmas, so lots of videos. So subscribe before you go. But let's start and see what I got her. This video is going to be much shorter <laughs> than it was for my son because she's so little. I really didn't get her much um, and the, the like gifts I did get her are a little bit more pricey so with my son I got him a lot of gifts I feel like but they were a little bit more cheaper and for her I kind of wanted to get more like thoughtful gifts and more um, gifts that she will like use for a long time since she is so little and she won't like be aware of what she's doing so the first thing I got her is a cuddle and kind doll I've been really wanting to get her the full size we have one of their miniature ones and then I also have like one of the little baby ones and I think they are the sweetest dolls they're so so soft and cuddly so I ended up getting her the full-size one this is the flamingo and this is actually named Penelope so I thought that, that was a cute thing to do I love flamingos and I think it'll go perfect in her room as well if you haven't heard of cuddle and kind before they are a family-owned business and they're a very sweet company they actually provide meals for children for each one of the dolls that you purchase they are also these dolls are um, handcrafted in Peru so they do provide jobs to um, people that are in need of jobs as well and they are all like handmade they're really great quality they just feel really soft and they are a little bit pricey so like I said some of her gifts are pretty pricey these dolls retail for I think it's like 80 I want to say this one is $80 so they're pretty pricey but um, I know it's something she'll have for a long time and like I said the quality is amazing and just knowing like you're donating at the same time is really great as well I did have a referral when I bought this so if you want to I can put down below a link I believe it's you receive $20 off um, for like using my referral it's not like um commission based or anything but if you do want to use that you can get $20 off a doll and um, I'll link that down below for you but I think this is really precious I was glad I was able to get her one of those and it comes like all nicely wrapped and um, in a nice box so it's a perfect gift if you're looking for this would make a great gift for like a toddler or young girl they also have little boy dolls too which are so sweet they have little like dogs and stuff so you can get them for your little boys as well so I did get her that and then I actually got her this little lovey this is from Pottery Barn. It's a little rabbit, which I thought was really cute. And it's so soft, you guys. It's so soft and cuddly. And then it has the silk right here. It also has the little um, thing. So you could actually connect a pacifier if you wanted to to it. But I didn't have a lovey for her yet. So I grabbed this one and I just thought it was too cute not to pass up. I can just like see her like snuggling this. So I got her that. And then um, I did get her some new bows. I am like a sucker for bows. I'm always buying them for her, but she didn't have any holiday bows. So I did get this holiday bow set. This was at TJ Maxx, pretty affordable. It was $5 for all of them. So there's a silver, green, black, red, white, and then also a beige. So perfect for the little holiday season. I'll probably throw one of the, <laughs> these on her for Christmas. Um, but they're the nylon ones so they can grow with them. I like these ones because they like get bigger with their heads so you'll get like more use out of them the older they get you can keep using them instead of the other ones that I feel like you can only use like if they're newborn or something so did get her that little set there like I said we'll probably use some of those for Christmas and then when I was at TJ Maxx I actually got her this set as well so this is a blanket and then also came with a little lovey I didn't mean to get both of these I'd actually already ordered this one for her and then I saw this set and it was super affordable I want to say it was like eight dollars for the blanket and the little lovey so I got it anyways so it's just a little blanket little rabbit so soft again super soft and cuddly and then she needed some more like thicker blankets just for like when we're in the car um or I like to throw them on her like if she's in her swing just like cover her feet and stuff so um it's a really plush really soft blanket and I love this color so that set was perfect so check TJ Maxx if you're looking for these type of blankets I know they can get really pricey like I like seen like a similar one at Target for like $20 and like I said this set together was under $10 for like both of these items so definitely check TJ Maxx for that I know I got her other one her rainbow one that I have her you guys probably see it in my blogs a lot that one was also from TJ Maxx and I want to say that one was like $7 so if you're looking for cozy blankets also muslin blankets are really affordable there too they have a lot of like three packs and stuff so that's a great spot to check for those and then I also got her this little wooden car her first little car and it's a really pretty pink color so I was gonna put this in her little stocking um, it's just like a little wooden car I got Rowan the I have his stuff next to me still but I got him this little helicopter for um, him so I got both of those and it's a Michigan owned business I found them on Etsy love supporting like local businesses so this was just too cute and I know I can use that um, 
in her room as decor too until she can play with it. And then I also got her this little outfit. I think she's going to wear this on Christmas because it's so cute. But this is what I got her um, to wear. So uh, technically it's not really a Christmas present. But like I said, her being so young, it's not like she's going to be able to even like unwrap anything or be able to grasp it. I know for Rowan's first Christmas, I think I only got him like a big gift. I got him his rocker. And then I also got him like a couple toys and some books. Like I didn't get him a lot because I know like he's not going to be aware of what's happening. So um, for her, I kind of did the same thing. But this is such a cute little outfit. I got it from Target. They have the cutest stuff. She's actually wearing an outfit from Target right now, but they have super, super cute little rompers there. So this was too precious. I love the little lace detail on it. Again, I'm going to link everything down below if you want to like check any of this stuff out. I'll link it all for you. And then her last like big gift is this um, jewelry box. And I know I shared this in another vlog, but if you are not subscribed and you haven't seen that one, I'll share it again. It is a jewelry box I got it from Pottery Barn and I just got her name personalized here on the top so this is something I feel like she'll have a long time it's like a keepsake item and um, like I said I didn't want to get her like a ton of stuff that I know like she doesn't need like a ton of toys and things so I just wanted to get her stuff that I knew that she could like have a long time like the doll and like things that I knew she needed like the bows and she didn't need the bows but the blanket and stuff so um just kind of with your littles I feel like it's like especially like their first Christmas I feel like I personally want to get stuff that like I know they'll have a long time instead of just like like I said a bunch of little toys and she has a ton from Rowan that she doesn't need so anyways um yes this is super cute it's pink they have them in different colors they have them in white as well but I did get it personalized so it says her name here on the top and then it is one of the little ballerina ones so you guys can see there it plays the music and then it has the little dancing ballerina inside. And then it has, let's see if I can get it to stop, but it has the different compartments. So you have a ring thing there in the middle. And then two, it's pretty deep actually, two little spots for jewelry. It also does come with a second little ballerina as well. So that is perfect too, that it comes with a second one. Um, and you can just like wind it up on the back. And then it also comes with a key, which, I was like where the heck is the key I was thinking I lost it it's not it's in the box I was like how did I lose that already I was worried I was going to actually lose it but um I didn't so it comes with a little key too so you can lock the jewelry box it actually locks so I did mention on my vlog the reason I wanted to get her this is because I always wanted one of these as a little kid and it was something that I never ended I like ended up getting so I always told myself if I had a little girl that I would get her one so I had to get this for her um and then the last thing that I have to show you guys is actually this little star. It's still in the plastic, but it's a little wand. Isn't this cute? Just like a little star wand. I thought I could put this in her room. It's like soft material. She's actually waking up. She's in her swing next to me, but um, it's soft material. And I thought this would be cute for her to play with. When she gets older, I'm really just going to probably use it as decor in her room. But I purchased her a Halloween costume on Etsy and when I did that to get free shipping because I'm a sucker for that I had to buy a few more things so I did get her this because I thought it was cute and she could use it I also got her another headband with that order but um, I saved it for Christmas I could put it in her stocking and then that is pretty much everything I got her I do have a few more books coming um, I did order her some books she doesn't really have a ton of like girly books yet she has um, a few books obviously they can share books of course and Rowan has so many books um, but I wanted to get her a few like little girly books that she could have for her room as well So I did get her some of those they haven't came yet But that's pretty much everything that I got for her I know this is like a shorter video and his was much longer But like I said, I wasn't trying to go too crazy with her this year just because I know that she won't you know know what's going on but I still did want to get her some just like thoughtful gifts and some things that I know she'll have a long time I hope you guys enjoyed this video and watching do not forget to subscribe if you have not already and make sure to check back in tomorrow for a brand new video and I'll see you next time